Hello friends, this video on number systems part 14 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Now we'll understand laws of exponent for real numbers. This is the last topic for this chapter. See, the laws of exponent says that if I have some number a to the power m and you multiply with some number e to the power n, you get some nothing but e to the power m plus n. Please pay attention here, very important concept for higher classes. For example, 5 to the power 2 into 5 to the power 3. This is nothing but 5 to the power 5. You can take, you can actually do your maths. Let's suppose 5 to the power 1 into 5 to the power 2. This is 5 and this is 25. You multiply this, how much you will get? 125. And I am saying this is nothing but 1 plus 2. That is 5 to the power 3. And 5 to the power 3 also you will get 125. Right, so a to the power m, a to the power n, you multiply, you get a to the power m plus n. Both these has to be a and you will add these. Okay, a to the power m to the power n is nothing but a to the power m n. For example, 2 to the power 1 to the power 2 is nothing but 2 to the or let's suppose 2 here. Or let's suppose 3 here. This becomes 2 to the power 6. Let's do that maths. 2 to the power 2 is 4. 4 to the power 3 is nothing but 4 into 4 into 4, okay, and this is nothing but 2 to the power 8, 6, sorry. So let's see this, 4 to the power 3 is 4 into 4 into 4, 2 to the power 6 is 2 into 2 into 2, 6 times, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Even if you don't calculate, this 4 is equal to this 2, this 4 is equal to these 2's, and these 4 equal to these 2's, if you see both are same okay if you actually want to do as 4 into 4 is 16 16 into 2 is 64 you can do this 2 into 2 4 8 16 32 64 both sides you get 64 right similarly a to the power m by n is nothing but root of a to the power m power n. This n comes here. Okay. a to the power m by a to the power n is nothing but a to the power m minus n. Similar to the first one. For example, 5 to the power 3 divided by 5 to the power 2 nothing but 5 to the power 3 minus 2 that is 5. You can actually solve this. 5 to the power 3 is 5 into 5 into 5. Okay. That is 5 into 5 into 5 into 5 and this is 5 to the power 2 is 5 into 5. These two cancel, you get 5 and you get 5 here. Okay, one more rule, a to the power m, b to the power m, you can actually say this has nothing but a b to the power m. So please note all these rules. Pause this slide, note down these rules, understand this, a to the power m, a to the power n, you multiply, you get a to the power m plus n a to the power m, a to the power n, you divide, you get a to the power m minus n. Similar rules. a to the power m to the power n, you actually multiply these two. Okay. Then a to the power m by n, actually this is nothing but a root. Because, for example, root of 5 is nothing but 5 to the power 1 by 2. It's the same. Okay. The same thing is coming here. Okay. And then this is this one. Not this one. If you have a to the power, both are m, let's suppose here, and you have two different uh, numbers here, you can actually club these and say to the power. You can actually take some examples and solve this. For example, if you say 2 to the power 3 into 1 to the power 3, right? So you can actually say this is nothing but 2 into 1 to the power 3. And here, if you see this is 8, this is 1, 8 into 1 is 8, this also you are getting 8. Okay? So let's take some examples for the formula we just saw. So we'll see the beauty of this formula, but we did not solve this completely and we can easily get the answer. 2 to the power 2 by 3 into 2 to the power 1 by 3, such a complicated expression. So this I can use at a to the power m, a to the power n is equal to a to the power m plus n. This formula I can use and I can write this whole expression as 2 to the power 2 by 3 into 2 to the power 1 by 3 
will be equal to 2 to the power 2 by 3 plus 1 by 3 that is nothing but 2 to the power 3 by 3 that is nothing but 2 to the power 1 that is nothing but 2. Pretty easy. This one 3 to the power m to the power n. This will become 3 to the power mn that is 3 to the power 4 by 5. That's all. Let's see this. 7 to the power 1 by 5 by 7 to the power 1 by 3. This I can say 7 to the power 1 by 5 minus 1 by 3. Similar to multiplication, division you to subtract. And there is nothing but 7 to the power minus 2 by 15. Let's take this. So here 13 and 17, this is common. 1 by 5 is common. So I can write this as 13 into 17 but to the power 1 by 5. That is nothing but 2 to 1 to the power 1 by 5. Okay. So we are just using the formulas we learned. 64 to the power 1 by 2. See, 64 to the power 1 by 2. Actually, to solve this, this is nothing but root 64. And this is we know is 8. 8 into 8 is 64. This one, 32 to the power 1 by 5. So 32 I can write as 2 into 2, 4, 8, 16, 32. That is 2 to the power 5. That is 32, right? I know that. So 32 to the power 1 by 5 I can write as, instead of 32 I can write 2 to the power 1 by 5, right? And this number, sorry, 32 is nothing but 2 to the power 5. 2 to the power 5, and this is 1 by 5. And this is nothing but 2 to the power 5 into 1 by 5. And this gets cancelled, that is 2 to the power 1, that is 1, 2. That is the answer. Similarly, 125 is nothing but 5 into 5 into 5. That is 5 to the power 3. So when I am given this expression 125 to the power 1 by 3, I can write as 5 to the power 3 and to the power 1 by 3. So a to the power a into b, I can write a to the power ab, that is 5 to the power 3 into 1 by 3. And this gets cancelled, you get 5 to the power 1, that is 5. Just simple application of the formulas we have learned. Let's take some example. 9 to the power 3 by 2. 9 I can write as 3 square. So I can write as 9 3 by 2 as 3 to the power 2 into 3 by 2. So a to the power m into n. That is nothing but a to the power m into n. That is 3 to the power 3. 3 to the power 3 is 27. Same thing. 32 I can write as 2 to the power 5. Just now I saw the last example. So I can write 32 to the power 2 by 5 as 2 to the power 5 to the power 2 by 5. This is nothing but 2 to the power 5 into 2 by 5. This gets cancelled that is 2 to the power 4, 2 to the power 2 that is 4. Let's take this. 16 I can write as 2 to the power 4. 2 into 2 into 2 into 2, 4 times. 2, 4, 8, 16. So 16 to the power 3 by 4, I can easily write as 2 to the power 4 and 3 by 4. And this I can write as 2 into 4 into 2 to the power 4 into 3 by 4. This gets cancelled. I get 2 to the power 3 and that is 8. Similarly, 125 I can write as 5 to the power 3. So 125 to the power minus 1 by 3, I can write as 5 to the power 3 and here minus 1 by 3 and this I can write as 5 to the power 3 into minus 1 by 3 this gets cancelled 5 to the power minus 1 is minus 1 by sorry 1 by 5 plus 1 by 5 okay 5 to the power minus 1 is 1 by 5 let's simplify a few more so this 2 2 is common and this is 2 by 3 this is 1 by 5 this will be nothing but 2 to the power 2 by 3 plus 1 by 5. A to the power m, a to the power n. This is nothing but 2 to the power, this is 15, this becomes 5 into 10 and this is 3. This is 2 to the power 13 by 15 and that is my answer.
let's take this 1 by 3 to the power 3 by 7 so this becomes 1 by 3 to the power 3 into 7 that is 1 by 3 to the power 27 that is 3 to the power minus 27 sorry it's 21 7 into 3 is 21 Let's take this one 11 to the power 1 by 2, 11 to the power 1 by 4. I can write as 11 to the power 1 by 2 minus 1 by 4. So a to the power m by a to the power n is a to the power m minus n. Same formula I can use here. So this becomes 11 to the power 1 by 4. 1 by 2 minus 1 by 4 is 1 by 4. Let's take the last numerical 7 to the power 1 by 2, 8 to the power 1 by 2. I can write as 7 into 8 to the power 1 by 2. This is nothing but 56 to the power 1 by 2. And that is my answer. This is a to the power m, b to the power m is nothing but a b to the power m. Thank you. Visit our website examfear.com to watch more and more quality educational videos. You can also attempt free online tests that are there in our website. You can also Get access to tons of free study materials and you can also find free tutors and mentors in this website. Thanks a lot for watching.